When the latest eruption in the Sununka crater chain of the Swatsengi volcanic system in Iceland started, the direction of the flow was toward the south. That was the general direction that the magma was slicing through the earth, creating that uh, chain of craters, and the lava resulting from that also flowing toward the south until it faced this barrier in the rectangle. It couldn't go any further. It just went along a tongue and then turned back toward the west, filled the quarry, mail hole. And that was the moment that it, uh, one million cubic meters of the lava actually uh, dumped into that and, uh, in a way, saved the Grindovic barrier walls, lava walls. Now we see another bridge closer to the chain of craters. You can see it just right now. This happened and the lava pond or pool break through their barrier, which was their natural barrier, the fault lines which created a little bit, you know, uplifting the ground usually. That was breached and the lava is now flowing toward the cameras, which are looking at the scene from the Thorbjorn. This is the position of them on this uh, satellite image by the uh, Icelandic meteorographics. I've marked it here. These uh, images are from the past few days. They are not up to date. But I'll just bring them up to date by these arrows. This is another thickness uh, uh, map showing the lava thickness in that area. And it follows the contour of the ground as I have done it. So the latest the Sentinel Copernicus image, which released today, is already obsolete. Meteor Meteoritic Office of the Iceland also released that image. That is now obsolete also. The new lava flow is flowing toward the west, closer to the chain of craters.